We're gonna move into our next one here. It's Game GPT. What's going on, guys? It's Devin, co-founder of Game GPT. How we doing? Thanks for kind of sending through the invite. Game GPT, as it sounds, is an AI-driven game builder. So what that entails is our AI models at uh, the end of a couple of text prompts or at the end of a few image prompts actually generates a game for you. The series of steps that it goes through is initially generating the code base for your game. Uh, step two is generating the 2D and 3D visual assets for your game. And then step three, which is kind of like the secret sauce on our end, is actually um, synthesizing that information into a compatible game engine like Unity or Unreal Engine. From there, you have your game and you can port that into our arcade, which is our website place where we have all of our games or our upcoming mobile app. It's going to have all of our mobile focused games. Or you can publish independently and uh, take the game wherever you may. That's the short of what Game GPT is. It is the cornerstone. It is the key piece in the overall Prism platform that is really in its own sense trying to tackle blockchain gaming in our own way. So really happy to be here and really happy to explain more about what we're doing. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. You're telling me that <laughs> I didn't have to build a game for three years. I could have just gotten to your text prompt, <laughs> typed it in and spit out a dope game, man. Jesus, bro. That's amazing, man. Yeah, I mean, we've been working really hard. The project Prism has been uh, in the works since 2020. And uh, we've been doing a ton of things. But Game GPT has been in the works since mid-2022. The approach and I guess the mission that we've had from the beginning, how can we be a technology-first company that lowers the barrier of entry of getting into Web3 for all? Our first product, which before Game GPT, was actually uh, skill-based wagering, which is actually live now and still has 100,000 registered users on it, is uh, what we call challenges. What that tool is, is a skill-based wagering tool sitting on top of the biggest Web2 games in the world, right? So right now we're integrated and partnered with League of Legends. We also just finished an integration with Dota 2. And uh, now that that's finished, we're actually going to have a Dota 2 tournaments launching 24th of this month. And our next games that we're integrating are actually going to be Counter-Strike 2, Valorant, and then uh, my personal favorite would be uh, Chess.com. Those partnerships going, I think Prism Challenges, which is its own product outside of GameGPT, we're just super stoked about. I guess to come back to GameGPT, mid-2022, everyone on our team's uh, eyes was on kind of like the AI craze and what was happening with OpenAI, ChatGPT3, and really everything else. We're building these skill-based wagering tools on top of existing games. What would incorporating AI technology to build our own games look like? And that is where we effectively maybe didn't take a pivot in what the company vision was, but understood the much bigger game that we were playing and really started to build out uh, the roadmap for the Prism project as it is now. So uh, the app that's coming soon, uh, obviously GameGPT, which is the centerpiece of it all, uh, was uh, really where it all came from.